Today's question is from Rav and Rav is asking how long do I spend researching a niche before I actually launch a product? How much time do I spend just researching other products, competitors, doing market research in general before I launch something in that niche? So the answer is, I don't do any of that type of traditional market research ever. First of all, if I decide to get into a niche or do something, it's always connected to something I'm passionate about. And if I'm passionate about something, for example, my first business was in the music industry. I was passionate about that. I wanted to be a music producer and that's the only thing that mattered to me. I didn't go out there and analyze the music market. I didn't go out there and looked at all my competitors and producers and analyzed it. That stuff is all up here. What got me started was my heart, my passion. So whenever I start a new business venture, I always start with passion and that's more important than anything else. So ultimately, I don't care how many competitors are out there, what other producers are doing. Like even as an entrepreneur right now, as a marketing teacher, I barely look at what other people are doing in my industry. There's a ton of people, there's a ton of YouTube channels, a ton of gurus. I used to follow all of these people in my early stages. Now I barely follow anyone. And the reason why is because I'm more connected to my passion now. I don't care what the marketplace is doing in terms of other gurus, other products and so forth. I'm just trying to develop my truth and bring my truth to my followers and I don't need other people for that. I don't need to analyze everything. As long as I'm connected to my passion, that will drive me and that will allow me to find solutions. So before you go into a niche, before you start a new business, ask yourself why are you doing it? Are you just trying to make money? Are you just trying to... Um, rip other people off and take value or are you really connected to a passion because passion will solve a lot of your problems not all of your problems i hate it when people say that passion is going to solve all your problems absolutely not the case but it's going to solve certain problems that you have in terms of motivation getting you started and focusing on the right thing so that's the first thing number two whenever i do market research I do what's called a seed launch and seed launch that's a term coined by Jeff Walker looking look him up if you don't know who is he's the, the product launch guy one of my mentors and a seed launch is a process where you take a small amount of people from a community you build up a small community on Facebook on social media a small email list and you can do that in almost any industry right I'm talking about building up a Facebook group with 200, 300 subscribers or um, you know people that are in the group, um, building up an email list of maybe 300 people or a forum. It really doesn't matter what type of platform you use. It can be Twitter, it can be a Facebook private group, it can be a forum, it can be even a YouTube channel. Um, but you want to build some sort of small community and reach critical mass in that community in that particular industry and then what you want to do is you want to do a seed launch which means you take a small amount of people maybe between 10 and 20 people from that initial community and you co-create a product with them which means you create a small seed launch community and you ask the people in there what are their needs what do they need help with and this can be used to develop software, to develop online courses, or just to do general market research. So you work together with this tight-knit seed launch community, and instead of creating a product that you think is going to be valuable, you let these people, this initial seed launch community, tell you exactly what their needs are, um, what they're working on, what isn't working out for them, because you can't think about this. You can't just make this up. You got to work with the marketplace and the closer you are to the marketplace, 
the better. So market research isn't something you do in your ivory tower disconnected from the marketplace. The best market research is done within your market. You want to mingle with your market. You want to dive into your market instead of being disconnected from it. Take a plunge in your market and surround yourself with your ideal prospects, with the people you'd like to work with, the people you'd like to sell something to. And that's how you learn the most about your market. But just becoming one of them, talking to them, engaging with them and being in a constant feedback loop. Really bad products are created because people and the creators of these products are not in a feedback loop with the marketplace. So a seed launch is an amazing tool to be in a constant communication and feedback loop with your marketplace and let them tell you exactly what they want and what would be of value for them. And that's how you create a great product. And that's how you do the market research almost on an unconscious level because you are consciously analyzing like what are the needs of these people and what could I create of value and what are their biggest fears. But by surrounding yourself for months with the people in your marketplace, by answering their questions, by engaging with them, by just being friends with them on Facebook and chatting with them, you will learn more about them, about their needs, their fears, their desires, their worst nightmares, um, what's valuable to them, the problems they're dealing with and so forth. You'll learn more about that just by talking to them, by, being, by building a friendship with them than by sitting there and having your analyst hat on your head and trying to analyze everything from a mental frame. So that's my ideas on what do you want to do when you go into a new industry. Start with passion, do a seed launch, don't fall into this traditional market research trap. Do a seed launch and reward these people in your seed launch community for helping you. Either you give them early access to your product or you give them a special edition of the product and sometimes you can even get your seed launch community to pay you for creating your product. Right? Give a special beta price for them. Tell them, look, the first 10 people I'm going to take into this pilot program, you're only going to pay me 20 bucks per month to be part of this product development process. You get early access to everything, you get a special edition, you, you, your name is going to be in the credits and um, it's going to be awesome. Right? Do a seed launch and never forget that your passion matters.